Fifth problem, find the least number which must be added to each of the following numbers to make it a perfect square. So we need to make these numbers as perfect square for that we need to add some number. Okay, so we need to find out what is the number. Okay, so let us write down in solution. First we will start what is the given information. Okay. So now we are going to solve the first bit that is 3720. So let us write down the given number is 3720. First we will find out the square root of this. So 3720. Now that we need to put the bars. Okay, we will start from the back side. So now we are having 37. We know that in squares, if you are writing the squares, 1 square is 1, 2 square is 4, 3 square is 9, 4 square is 16, 5 square is 25, 6 square is 36. So this is the nearest number to 37. So let us write down 6 into 6. So we are getting 36. Next we will subtract. We will get 1. If we subtract 36 from 37, we will get 1. Now bring this 20 down. So we will get 120. Let us write down 6 again. So 6 plus 6 is 12. Now we know that the nearest number to 120 is 121. Because if we write down 1 here, we will get 120. One. Okay, so we are getting the lowest number is we are which we are getting is one twenty one when we are writing one here. Okay, so if we are writing one here, we are getting one twenty one. For that, let us write down the square of sixty. So a square of sixty, we know that it will be the square of six is thirty six and square, square for 0 is double 0 ok next square of 61 we know the square of 61 it is 3 7 2 1 so which one is greater 61 square is greater than 60 square so let us write down 61 square is greater than this number also what is the number 3 7 2 1 so 61 square is greater than 3720 and 3721 is greater than 60 square. So the nearest square is 61. If we add 1 to 3720, we will get 61 square. So thus let us write down if we subtract, okay, if we subtract 372 if we subtract 3720 from 3721 we will get 1 okay so the number to be added is 1 hence the number to be added is 1 to make it a perfect square we need to add 1. Now let us solve the second bit. So in the second bit, the given number is, so let us write down the given number. So the given number is 115580. First, we are going to find its square. So, 11, 115580. Let us write down the first, we will put the bar for two, two digits. Okay. So, we know that one square is one, two square is four, three square is nine, and four square is sixteen. So, in the first, that is 11 is there. So the nearest number is 3 square 9. So let us write down 3 into 3. So 3 3 is 9. 
Now, this. Uh, now let us subtract. If you subtract nine from eleven, we will get two. And let us bring this fifty-five down. Next, we will write down five here, three here. So three plus three is six. Next, we need to find out what is the nearest number to twenty-five in six table. So that is, we know that six four is a twenty-four. But if we take four, it will get increased. So that's why we will take three. So let us find out sixty-three into three. So three three is a nine. Three four three six is a eighteen. So it is one eighty-nine. So let us take this number. So one eighty-nine. Next, let us write down three again. So six six uh, three plus three is six. Now let us subtract. If we subtract of nine from fifteen, we will get six, and if we subtract eight from fourteen, we will get six. So now we are getting sixty-six. Now bring this eighty down, so we will get eight zero. Next, so the nearest number to this, if we are taking six, so six tens are sixty. We know that. So we, if we take six ten. It will get increased, so we will consider nine. So let us do that. Six, six, nine, nine. So nine, nine is eighty-one. Nine, six is fifty-four. Fifty-four plus eight is sixty-two. So nine, six is fifty-four. Fifty-four plus six is sixty. So this is the nearest number. So with nine, we are getting this. So six zero two one. Let's subtract. So if we are subtracting one from ten, we will get nine, and if we subtract two from seven, we will get five, and this is the six. So six hundred and fifty nine we are getting. So next we will write down the square of this square of three hundred and thirty nine. So we know the square of three hundred and thirty-nine. So let us write down the square of three hundred and thirty-nine. So that is one one four nine two one. Okay, and also the square of three hundred and forty. So the square of three hundred and forty, we know that one one five six double zero. So three hundred and forty, the square of three hundred and forty is greater than. The given number because it is here it is five eighty so twenty more is required okay so let us write down the square of three hundred and forty is greater than one one five 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 eight zero okay which is uh, greater than the square of three hundred and thirty nine so is needed. To make it the square of three hundred and forty, we know that it is twenty. So let us write down that. So one one five six double zero minus one one five five eight zero. So we will get twenty. So to make it a perfect square, so the number to be added is twenty. Hence the number. To be added is twenty. Now, third bit that is four nine three one. So let us solve that. So let us write down the given number. So the given. Number is four nine three one. So in this number, we can see that it is four nine three one. So let us find out its square four nine three one. Let's put the bar. So the first number is forty nine. So we know that it's the square of seven. So let us write down seven 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 zero. Forty-nine. Next, the remainder is zero. 
so let us bring this 31 down so let us write down 7 again so 7 plus 7 is 14 so we are getting 14 and the remainder here is 31 so now directly if we take 0 here so it will be if we will get 0 okay so let us find out the square of 70 first so we know the square of 70 so that is 4900 okay and the square of 71 so 7 square we know that 49 but for finding this one according to the trick we will get 50 and the square of 21 is 441 so leave the 4 just write down 41 so the square of 71 is 5041 next so which one uh, this 71 square is greater okay so let us write down 71 square is greater than 4931 and which is greater than 70 square so that now we need to subtract if we subtract 4931 from 5041 we will get the required number so let us subtract 5041 minus 4931 so we will get 1 minus 1 is 0 4 minus 3 is 1 and if we subtract 49 from 50 we will get 1 so it is 110 so hence let us write down hence the number to be added is one one zero.